Hey, what's going on, YouTube? In today's video, I want to come on here and give you guys Kwame's reaction to Shannon Sharp's exit from Undisputed. The first video I did covering this topic, I had said a lot of people were speculating that Kwame Brown had something to do with it. So with that being said, man, I want to come find Kwame Brown's reaction and give it to you guys. Let's get right into this clip, and I'll be right back with some more commentary. Here's the video. Oh, my goodness. LeBron, they ain't protect this boy. You about to lose your job. You know what? I'm not going to celebrate no man losing their job. I don't think he lost his job. I think he is going to uh, pump up Club Shay Shay. I think he's going to get another job. Yeah, but he definitely lost the undisputed job. I think he lost the undisputed job because of uh, <clears throat> trying to beat up John Morant, father, and whole um, Memphis Grizzlies. I think they launched an investigation. And during the launch of this investigation, they figured that Shannon Sharp is a fanboy. And they took my my instructions and what I said was going to happen. I think they took that to heart. I said Shannon Sharp was going to beat somebody half to death <laughs> over LeBron next year. I sure did. I said Shannon Sharp was going to beat somebody half to death over LeBron next year. I predicted that. And I think the folks that hired him said, you know what? I think he's right. There's been speculation that the bus got Shannon Sharp out of there, but we didn't do nothing. All, all we did, and this wasn't me, this just showed a behavior that this guy is not an analyst. He's a fanboy. And I think there's supposed to be a level of integrity when you do what he what he's, was doing. You cannot. It's definitely your fault. No, it ain't. No, it ain't. And see, now he can be an actual fan. He can come down here with everybody else and be an actual fan. He can wear LeBron James jerseys every day. He can buy his ticket to the game still. And, you know, he got more time that he can spend with LeBron. When you lose your job, blame Kwame Brown. Uh -uh. Why did this happen? Why did do something or oh, to something seem like he might be doing something after to something? Why did he step down, lose his job, whatever, allegedly? I think it's because of the fight and the fanboy. You can't be an analyst and a fanboy. Shannon, look, how you feel now that you called me a seven-foot farmer on that white boy station, and then they kicked your ass out right after that? <laughs> how you feel now, Shannon, you calling me a seven-foot farmer? Now we don't know what the fuck you do. You unemployed. Okay, so that's what Kwame Brown had to say. And, you know, Kwame denies that he had anything to do with Shannon Sharp leaving Undisputed. But Kwame is saying that Sharp can be a true fanboy now. He can buy the tickets. He can go argue with the fans. He can argue with the players now without really having to abide by company policies. So that's what Kwame Brown had to say, man. Give a like if you made it this far in the video. I'll have the full video down below. Salute to Kwame, his editors. And, um, yeah, man, that's it for today's video. Catch you guys on the next one. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. And we out, man. Peace.